do you ever have that moment where you step back and think about how something you use every day actually work? Have you ever stopped to consider exactly how email or streaming video gets into your smartphone or tablet so quickly? That's Wi-Fi in action. Today, I'm going to be showing you how Wi-Fi works. Without no further ado, let's get started. What is Wi-Fi? Wi-Fi stands for Wireless Fidelity. And this is the same as saying WLAN, which means Wireless Area Network. Wi-Fi works of, of the same principle as other wireless devices. It uses radio frequencies to send signals between devices. Radio frequencies are completely different from that of walkie-talkies, car radios, cell phones, and weather radios. For instance, car stereos receive frequencies in kilohertz and megahertz gain. A computer's wireless adapter translates data into a signal and transmits it using an antenna, while a wireless router receives the signal and decodes it, that is the AM and FM station, and Wi-Fi transmits and receives data in the gigahertz range. At a high level, this is how all wireless communication works. However, Wi-Fi has a four notable differences from other technologies. For instance, Wi-Fi transmits frequencies of 2.4 gigahertz or 5 gigahertz. These frequencies are much higher than the frequencies uses for cellular transmission higher frequencies means that signal can carry more data however all forms of wireless communication represent a trade-off between power consumption and bandwidth so in exchange for high data rates wi-fi consumes a lot of power and doesn't have a lot of Range Hertz is simply a unit of frequency. Let's say you are standing on a pair, watching waves come in. As you look down at the waves, you can see the crest of each wave rolling by. If you counted how many seconds between each wave crest, this would be the frequency of the wave. So, if the time between each crest was one second that would mean the wave frequency was one at or one cycle per second comparing c waves to megahertz and gigahertz these waves are moving at one million and one billion cycles per second in the hair and to receive the information found in the waves your radio receiver needs to be set to receive waves of a certain frequency. To cap it all, I will be giving you difference between Wi-Fi and the internet. As I said earlier, Wi-Fi works with radio waves. Wi-Fi continually broadcasts out to your devices. As long as your devices can pick up that radio signal and the internet is on the other side of it, your devices can connect to the internet. However, that radio signal will still be there even if there is no internet connection on the other hand. If you enjoyed this video, Click on like button to make this video beat YouTube's algorithm. 
subscribe and ring the bell to keep you updated on my latest video